we're downtown Portland here again, waiting on the verdict. There's still no answer back from the jury, uh, but we're down here cooking, uh, grilling hamburgers and hot dogs, giving them all away. Uh, anybody who comes by or that wants anything to eat, we're feeding them. Matt Schindler's here waiting with us. We've got one of the lawyers down here. Hey, how you doing, sir? A lot of flags. Here with a uh, A lot of people showed up. We got our little stand out here. Two barbecue grills going today. And a lot of people down here waiting on an answer. Thanks for coming. Glad you came. Yes. Nice Good. to meet you in person. Oh, yes. All the time. Yes, okay, thanks. <laughs> Doing my noon live stream here, letting everybody know what's going on. Right. No verdict yet. We are political prisoners. That's right. So, no verdict yet. We're just down here waiting, eating, giving away food. We got a big box of Ammon Bundy's apples from his orchard. Lisa Bundy dropped them off, giving them away too. Been a busy morning down here. Got Brand over here drinking coffee. He's kind of slacking on the job. No, no noise right now. No show far. He'll blow it in a minute though before we're done. <laughs> he don't take a break much. <laughs> so again, there's no no answer yet from the jury. No answer. We're just uh, still waiting patiently down here. In good spirits, everybody is. We're giving away a lot of food. You don't have to pay for it, but you can check it. Yeah. Okay. There's some water, some chips, whatever you want. So. Uh, you don't have any regular Pepsi. We have a regular Dr. Pepper, but no regular Pepsi yet. No. Okay. Water. Water. Okay. Give her a water, Josiah. Would you like more ketchup on the other side? We'll get somebody here to come with you right now. We're doing a live stream. You brought a horse? One or two? <laughs> okay. I'll get somebody with you in just a second. Hey, Dwayne. Hey, Dwayne. Dwayne. Hey, Dwayne. Hey, Dwayne. Can you go with her real quick in the horse trailer to help her park? Oh, uh, just go go with her real quick. Uh, tell her to go up here. Or maybe ride with her. Go go up here to this next street right here. Go across the bridge. You'll find a place over there. So we got another horse down here. The join Lady Liberty today. So you'll make a make a left right here. Go across the bridge, and you'll find a place to park. Okay. It's. Getting busy down here. Still waiting on a verdict. He built nine ponds and uh, drilled, dredged up uh, mining tailings and. Uh, yep. And <laughs> who knows who's telling him this about? Joe Robertson. We're standing with Joe Robertson. Carrie Robertson called the other night. She talked to us about an hour and 45 minutes. She's doing real well. She needs Joe home, though. And we need all the help we can get for Joe to, to try to get uh, people in there to visit him. The, um, the jail down there in Colorado right now is refusing anybody to visit. So we're having a hard time getting people on that list. But we got a nice crowd down here.
So we'll we'll do another live stream about five o'clock or maybe before if we get a verdict. I'll do one on the spur of the moment. I'll give everybody about five or ten minutes, give you a notice. Okay. I think they'll ask us. More food coming. You want another one? Uh -huh. I said I was going to come back to Say hi. Where are you going? Ammon and Ryan and David Fry, they're sitting over in the federal courthouse in a holding facility area that's, um, that they're waiting a verdict. I've been told they're, they're chained or handcuffed inside of there for several hours, maybe all day long while we're waiting on the verdict. It's cruel and unusual punishment. It's wrong. They should never treat nobody like that. You would, the holy. you would think that great big old building there cost billions of dollars, whatever it cost, to do the unrighteous, wicked things they're doing, that they would at least treat people humanely. That's one of the things that I'm the most disgusted with, is our prison system, how they treat people, how they lock people up. It's not right. Over here is the jail again, to the right of that big round dome is where Ryan and Ammon stay. Up on top, that looks like a caged area. Above the little windows, that's the rec room. Okay, we're gonna go okay. These, this injustice in this prison system needs to stop. Well, again, I'll um, I'll sign back in about five o'clock tonight and let you know how things are going. Hopefully, we have an answer during the day. I'll uh, for sure update you at five o'clock, if not before. I'm hoping for two or three weeks so we can enjoy uh, congregating downtown and having a good time and barbecues and all that good stuff. But, you know, that's me. David's not buying the food. <laughs> but it is fun, David. David's been here Fellowship. the longest. Fellowship, man. <laughs> what it's about. You can have another hot dog. Oh, Pops, you can have a pop, too. Help yourself. Look at all the pop and soda that just got brought. On the blind time. More food that we can just give away. Well, I guess I'll sign off, everybody. Thanks for being a part of our day here. We'll keep you posted throughout the day and for sure again at 5.30, or between 5 and 5.30. Thanks a lot and God bless. We're down here and uh, still uh, waiting on an answer from the jury, but we've got some news here, and we're uh, give everybody a chance here to get on here, give you guys an update. We're uh, still giving away food down here. We gave probably uh, well, we gave over 40 hamburgers away and probably 150 hot dogs so far. But we've got some information here you want to share with you guys. We think it's crucial information. And uh, we think it's uh, God sent, and it's going to be some information here. I'll let uh, Bran here tell you what we just found out from the what we're hearing from the jury. Well, um, just a little while ago, say 20 minutes or so ago, there's some attorneys here, and some of the defendants, I mean witnesses, and they they just went into the uh, courtroom, um, and then we just got notice that the jury has a question for the defense, and the defense attorney said if we find three people not guilty, do we have to find them all not guilty, which absolutely is the case. Um, they have all been tried for conspiracy. You find one not guilty, two, three, they're all not guilty. 
So, yes, I believe this is an absolutely good sign and a God's hand. So what we're hearing is um, that the, the jury had a question, and that question is that they see that they think that three of them are for sure not guilty, and they want to know if, if they have to find all of them not guilty because of um, three of them they consider not guilty. So that question is being answered and asked right now by the jury. And um, the defense team, the prosecution team, and all of them have just yeah. headed up there. And they're right now in the courtroom with the jury trying to get this question answered. And the, uh, the wives are there also. They're allowing the wives in to, to be there and to witness this. And I just, you know, it, it just comes up as good signs all the way around. It's good news. Um, I, I think we're going to get an answer here pretty quick now. With this, um, this coming out today, we might get one yet today even, as early as tomorrow. So stay tuned. We'll keep any, any new updates. We're going to let you know. But um, right now they, the jury is thinking that three of them are not guilty, and that only leaves four others. So I think they're going to find them all not guilty. This, this is great news. So it's, let's don't slack in our prayers. Let's hammer it home. Exactly. Keep keep your prayers up. Keep praying hard. Uh, the jury is uh, serious here. We've got a good jurors. We can tell that by the questions they're asking here today. And um, so we'll keep you updated as much as we can. Um, we'll have a final update again. It's like I said, about five o'clock, if not before. So thanks, Mary. Pray harder and harder. Yes. Thanks a lot. I anybody, like that comment. Anybody have any more questions? Uh, we'll try to answer a couple questions before we get off of here. It, um, but um, so the jury thinks that three of them are not guilty at this point, and they're considering making all of them not guilty. That is the question what they was wanting to ask the the judge, the defense, and the prosecution team. So they're up there right now. Let's uh, keep praying that something good happens with this. So we'll let you guys go for now. We'll um, check back in with you a little bit later today. God bless.